Hi everyone, um, I haven't done one of these videos for a while, so it's probably a little bit overdue. Um, I just want to say thanks to uh, all the friends and subscribers of Oxford Shortwave Log, uh, as we've now hit 600 subscribers. We're actually up at 613, um, which is amazing. Um, you know, I've said it before, I never imagined that there'd be so many people that would have an interest in what I'm doing. Um, and it's testament as well to the fact that, you know, shortwave radio, DXing, you know, there's still a lot of people out there that are interested in it and that actively participate in the hobby. And this is, you know, in the context of, you know, Radio Australia recently announcing that, you know, they're switching off their transmitters. Um, so I'm really grateful. Uh, and I just wanted to share that with you. Um, you'll have to excuse me, I'm feeling slightly rough as I went out last night with some work colleagues for Christmas drinks that went on a bit too long really. Um, so if I'm sounding a bit husky, I apologise. Um, so since a year last August, so effectively 18 months, uh, we have 613 subscribers. Uh, 800 of my videos are in playlists. Um, 4,280 videos have been shared um, and just over 6,000 comments. You know, it's incredible. Um, 6,609 likes. I'm just reading this from the analytics um, uh, on YouTube. So yeah, 6,609 likes, 51 dislikes. So sorry that I've upset a few people. <laughs> um, a total watch time of 148,259 minutes. Um, yeah, and 113,258 views. So... You know, that's pretty incredible. Uh, having said that, I've uploaded a lot of videos in the last 18 months, um, over 1,100. But, you know, I am very grateful that people are interested. You know, the fact that I've got over 600 subscribers, you know, is amazing. I know compared to the big boys, it's still small potatoes. But, um, you know, this is a one-man band. And, um, yeah, I'm grateful to everybody that shows an interest. Um, and whether they like or dislike... Uh, it doesn't really bother me. Um, it goes with the territory. Uh, in terms of the most watched videos, it's kind of dominated by the ELAD, uh, FDM duo. Um, and it, But it's interesting because in terms of watch time, the video that uh, has more watch time than anything than any of the others is my video about the the ELAD, how to use it for shortwave listening without a computer, which is has a total watch time of over eight and a half thousand minutes and it has two and a half thousand views um but in terms of views which has 2700 and something uh the video regarding the elad in a sort of quick spin around the software um is the most popular but it's been watched for 5282 minutes i mean i'll have to check maybe it's a short video um then there are several videos with over a thousand views. Um, the ELAD, what you get in the box, has 1800 views, over 1800 views. Six different methods of tuning. Uh, the ELAD has over 1200. Um, so they're the most popular. Um, what's also popular actually is the Texan PL360. Uh, I ran an ETM scan, I think, with a 100 meter long wire attached to it. It sounds crazy, but. Uh, it's been watched for over 2,000 minutes and has over 1,200 views. Um, I did a video of the Roberts R9962 versus the £8 Tesco supermarket radio, uh, which has been watched for uh, over 2,000 minutes and has over 1,200 views. Um, and then there's a couple of videos on the uh, Wellbrook, um, how to um, uh, assemble and what parts to buy. has. 17 over 1700 views and then a, my quick tripod mounting solution for putting up in the garden something i actually don't do anymore has 1800 views um so they're the most popular so you know i have eight there's eight videos that have over a thousand views um and then there's lots that have several hundred views but you know as i said uh you know it's amazing really that so many people are interested and um, thank you to all my friends you know i've learned a lot I've tried to give advice where I can, but you know I'm still kind of relatively new to this. I've only really been doing it, you know, properly for 18 months. 
Uh, I've made a lot of friends. You guys know who you are. Um, and, you know, I'm just really grateful and I'm really enjoying it. Um, I'm going to do another video uh, which, which will kind of review what I've got coming up next. Um, there's a couple of new receivers and I've got a couple of new antennas, so I'm going to do a separate video on that. Um, and I'm also going to do another video um, and just show you guys what might be the world's smallest collection of QSL cards, something that I don't really do very much. Um, but I thought I'd share it with you because I've got a few views on to, on, on whether to QSL or not. Uh, but in the meantime, uh, I hope you're enjoying the videos. There'll be lots more to come. Um, and I wish you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Thanks for watching.